Y bienvenidas a un nuevo vídeo del canal Estamos aquí de vuelta con New Tales from the Borderlands Soy Joss Herrero y estamos aquí con nuestra video guía Para completar esta aventura y divertirnos a tope Con las decisiones y todo lo que tomemos E intentar conseguir todo, 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 todo lo posible en esta gran partida Lo primero de todo deciros que he hecho una pequeña votación al final Con el tema de toma de decisiones Es algo que en este tipo de juegos me gusta Y aunque parezca una tontería y esté el pobre curro de Anu en juego Ha llegado el momento de disparar a lo que más porcentaje ha obtenido, tengo que decir que literalmente en la encuesta me ha sorprendido, pero nadie ha votado por esta cosa de aquí, todos han votado, esto me habéis comentado que es una foto de la hermana de Fiona del Tales from the Borderlands 1 y esto pues es una especie de, money, de traje, ¿no? Pues bien, con un 49% de los votos se ha quedado esto atrás, porque es lo que digo, esto no ha recibido un bote, y con un 51% pues le toca el disparo a esto, me da rabia porque es a lo último lo que hubiera disparado, pero allá vamos y a ver cómo continúa nuestra aventura y a ver a dónde mandamos eso ahí. Bring it back. Bring Sasha and Tiny Reese back. That was a custom figure. And the only picture of Sasha that I have. Had. Okay, okay, okay. Impressive. It's very impressive. Now, you know, reverse phase. <laughs> Unzap. De-eliminate. Bring it back. There's no reverse switch, sir. It only does the one thing so far. It's a prototype. <laughs> well, where the hell did it send my stuff? No, I, I uh, do not know. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just... Gone? Maybe I can ask Fiona. Maybe I can find Fiona. Mr. Strong Fork! CEO of the Atlas Company. I am your assistant. Uh, yeah, Timmy, I know. Then now is my time to shine! Let me assist you! Wait, 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 Timmy, what? I will go on a quest to retrieve what you have lost, huh? Rescue mission! You would do that? For me? Of course I would. Mr. Strongfork! CEO of the Atlas Company. Doing anything and everything for you is literally the purpose of my existence. Yikes. Yeah, well, that's a fair point, actually. All right. Dr. Dar? Let's try this again. I'm Timmy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Le tengo que dar a Timmy. Esto, esto no va a acabar bien. I'm ready. Pull the trigger. No sé dónde lo estoy llevando, pero se ha ido. Timmy. Timmy! If he doesn't come back, you'll be hearing from me. <laughs> Pero si ha sido... Specifically the sound of my tears. <laughs> He'll definitely come back. Algún <laughs> día. Someday. Can I just say, for a gun... Device. ...that's designed to be non-lethal, that thing is really doing some damage. Thank... you? Not a compliment. You can't control it. You barely know what it does, except that it doesn't kill things, which makes it useless. It isn't designed to kill. Not everything needs to harm people. I feel harmed. I feel very personally harmed. Just not in a way that's profitable. Oh my god, why? Oh, Timmy, where are you when I need you most? <sighs> You've reached Reese Strongfork, the CEO of Atlas Corporation. Well, well, if it isn't Reese Strongfork. 
<laughs> Susan Coldwell, CEO of TDR. Why, why are you calling me? You know what, can you hold on for just a sec? Dr. Dar, you may go. And if it wasn't clear already, uh, you're fired. What, sir? <laughs> Susan, how they hang in. <laughs> Perky as ever, Reese. And you, eyes and limbs, all accounted for? Oh, yep. All good over here. Doing no? just great. Susan. Better than. Was there uh, something you needed? Okay, parece que toca de nuevo volver un poquito a Octavio, así que vamos a ver qué pasa por aquí. Me está molando mucho, eh. Until they say their full name out loud and I am able to confirm its match against the name in the database. That's where you come in. So you must get my target to say their full name out loud. Lo sé, lo sé. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. The same my first rodeo. What is a rodeo? Oh, it's when like ranchers ride bucking. You know what? Never mind. Very well. <laughs> what did they do? Whoever you're about to kill. A man named Jamison Harwin kicked his neighbor's pet scat pup. So the neighbor contracted me to punish him. Eso es todo? And skags are awful. No, this one was cool. Psst, I doubt a skag. It learned how to ride a skate. ¿Qué? Un skage monopatín, tío. Show me that skag kicking piece of trash right now. Vale. Me mola mucho, tanto Lob 13 como Octavio son bastante majos. Eh, ¿Cuál es tu flor favorita? Yeah, just one. What's your favorite flower? Posies. Los ramos. Posies? Posies. Pero, pero eso son. A single ah. posy is worthless, but they're delightful in a bunch. Posies. Posies. Jamison Harwin lives in that apartment complex. Vale, Harwin vive allí, ¿no? Hay que llamar a la puerta 3, vale. Vale. All right, let's get the skag kicking piece of crap. Ok, pues parece que estamos aquí de misioncita, así que no vamos a perder el tiempo. Llamamos. Entra la pizza. If this is some kind of prank, I'm gonna come out there and beat your ass. Yeah, I got a pizza here for apartment three. What? I didn't order any pizza. No offense, but are you by any chance drunk, sir? W well, yeah. How the hell is that relevant? Drunk folk order pizza, then forget about it. Happens all the time. Think of me as a present from your past self. All right. <risa> bueno, lo hemos conseguido rápido que baje. Uh, todo va bien. Well, I must admit your methods are strange. It seems to have worked. Now you must get him to say his full name before I can fulfill the contract. No problem. Give it here, kid. What gives? I come all the way down here and you don't even got it? You better not be messing with me, boy. I got a hell of a temper. Oh, dang. I forgot it in the car. I knew I was forgetting something. Uh, but before I go, can you confirm your full name for me? Yeah, it's Jameson Harwin. Now get moving. Hola. You just got L0 U1. De hecho, un low 13. <laughs> Did I do it right? Nailed it. That's what you get, Scat Kicker. <laughs> well done. I have received payment. Here is your commission, friend Octavio. Ooh, cash money. Make it rain. I'm meeting the Kurobakos, you in? I am indeed in. Though I still cannot fathom how you can eat food from a man who lives in the sewers and befriends Ratch. I use a lot of hot sauce? 
<risa> pues nada, parece que el, el primer objetivo aquí de estos dos ha sido una pasada. Lo hemos conseguido rápido y bueno, nos vamos a, a comer tacos, ¿no? Era? You mentioned your past proclivity for stealing. As you know, many of my contracts have been for idiot petty thieves, such as yourself. Now, your sister. Anu. Your sister Anu disapproves of this proclivity and wishes for you to stop stealing. Are you heeding her counsel? It is a dangerous hobby, Lasni. Escucha mi hermana. I'm trying. I listen to my sister. The two of us, Anu is the smart, responsible one. Yeah. How did you know? Because you are certainly the impulsive, irresponsible one. And you have wonderful people skills. Oh, Octavio. Hi. Louis. Let me introduce you to Diamond Daniel. A real thief and definitely not an idiot. Daniel Diamante, una auténtica ladrona y para nada una idiota. Creo que es la tía que le mola a Octavio, ¿no? That's one way to introduce a friend. Sure. Greetings. Diamond Daniel must be a moniker. Since it obscures your real name, I have a 0% probability of killing you. Are you flirting with me, robot? No. Real charmer. He's working on his people skills. I am not. We're on our way to Pacos to meet up with Radon. Wanna come? Tacos? I'm there. You are not. We must ambulate there. Ignore him. Bueno, pues parece que nos vamos a por tacos. Pues a por tacos que vamos. Me está haciendo gracia, me está pareciendo muy divertido lo que estamos viendo en la Ojo que estamos otra vez con Sam, entiendo. Behind the counter, Octavio, killing me. Vale, no cliente. <coughs> you want to help me? You'll give me what I asked for, and you know damn well what that is. Henry? Hank. What brings you around these parts? Same as always. You owe me for protection, and my price ain't budging. You know, usually a protection shakedown involves actually protecting a place. Didn't see you anywhere when Malawan was blasting holes in my store. Don't blame me for the whims of our corporate overlords. There's only one thing I want, and it's time to pay up. Ugh, I'm sorry, but there's no way I can give you a lifetime of free Froger tank. Not at the rate you eat it. Why? Huh? Do it! Hey, do it, or I'm gonna kill you! That's how it's gonna be? I tried to be patient. But you feed me enough frozen yogurt to keep me on a 24-7 sugar high, or I feed you the tip of this pick! Mm. I'm through asking. You're gonna give me what I want, or we're gonna have a dozen flavors worth a problem. You Largo, si no quieres complicar las cosas. Conversation ends up. Mm, sounds like somebody fell off the anger wagon. 90 days clean. You play your cards right, and we both might live to see 91. No, maybe. Maybe I just kill you and take this place over for myself. Yeah. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. Hank, un pedazo de cabrolado. And frankly, what would be the difference? Huh? Whether it be an ice pick to the eye or slowly wasting away in debt to the team corporation, you are dead. Either way. Face it, friend. You failed. Maybe you could have been somebody once upon a time, but that was a good 10,000 Frogerts and a Malawan laser ago. You have got nothing. No. I'm sorry, that was too generous. You are nothing. No no reason reason we have to get murderous today. Sure there is. It'd be fun. Now. Die quick. I'm hungry. That's a shame. 
You've come an awful long way just to die on an empty stomach. Yeah. Ahí va. Come on. Los cutes van rápido, eh, por cabrón. Es tu última oportunidad. I was really hoping this didn't have to get violent. Far as last words go, five out of ten. Oh, jeez! Oh, oh no! Is that blood? Am I bleeding? I tried to be nice, but this time you've gone too far. Oh oh, lo vamos a congelar. Sí. Vamos a dejarlo tranquilo. Ahí te quedas, amigo. Hala. Now you just stay here and you think about. Hemos conseguido que no explote con la ira, eh. Poca broma. Here's hoping for a hundred, eh? You hush, or I'll break you into cubes and serve you in lemonade. Coming, dear. Vale, eh, eh, eh. vale. Estamos de vuelta con Anu entonces. What am I gonna do now? Y nos han despedido. Where am I gonna go? I mean, we're in space. I live here. <laughs> What's Octavio gonna say? No te preocupes ahora por Octavio, Maybe pero cuéntate que has perdido el trabajo. Ya sabéis, Anu es la hermana Octavio. Tenemos una, <ríe> un dispositivo aquí, la like voz. Y acabamos de mandar, Someone hemos mandado a Tiny <ríe> la foto de Sasa, la hermana de Fiona, la coprotagonista oh, hey, o, la, o la protagonista Anu. también no femenina, por así decirlo, del Tales from the Borderlands 1. Fiona molaba mucho. Killed? <laughs> That's a little dramatic, Fong. I got fired. It's a setback, sure, but not a death sentence. What? You got fired? Yikes and a half. That sucks. Wait, does that mean I'm fired too? You know what? Forget it. Not even on my list of things to stress about right now. We are in the middle of a TDR invasion with dudes in body armor and guns of an admittedly lower quality than Atlas's. The whole shebang. So Hoy no es mi día. let's go. An invasion by a rival weapons manufacturer. And I'm fired. And it's not even lunch. On the upside, the vet sent an echo. Your pet fish is doing great. Oh. Wait. I misread. It's uh dead. Sorry. It's okay. The words look similar. Yeah, so remember when Malawan tried to stage a hostile force takeover of Atlas back on Promethea? Of course, I'm from Promethea. It was devastating for Atlas, and they blew up Strong Fork's favorite Frogert place or something. No, yeah, actually, my brother works there. Well, I guess TDR smelled blood in the water and decided it's their turn to take a stab at Atlas because they are a hundo P boarding this facility right now, and it is hostile. Like, very, very hostile. How do you know all this? Oh. Employees of Atlas, let's all give our surprise guests from TDR a warm welcome and show them what makes Atlas the company it is. And by warm welcome, I of course mean show them everything we've been working on lately at close range. Let's be elsewhere fast. <laughs> you felt weird. Oh crap! Hide, hide, hide! Shh, tranquila. Vente aquí. If you were keeping an active vault key somewhere on your space station. Where would you hide it? Boss lady said it's in his office, so that's where we're going. I just don't underestimate this guy. All right? Affirmative. I heard he ripped his own eyeball out. It's kind of crazy you don't mess with. Shh. 
Gentlemen, lovely to see you. I'd offer you a beverage, but my assistant Timmy was recently teleported to God knows where. Reese Strongfort, we are here for the vault key and or your bloodied corpse. Hey, fellas, come on. Come in. Have a seat. Say, would either of you be interested in a career change? We've got some killer benefits. Could I get a cocktail? Fired during a hostile takeover? Yeesh! Bet you can kiss your severance package goodbye. Oh no. I've got it right here. Uh oh. That door wasn't broken the last time I came through it. That's the thing about hostile takeovers. They're hostile. Hey, smell like guilty shame. Can you mommy bring a pack lunch? Resistance is highly frowned upon. What's frowning? <laughs> We're frowning. Hay que esperar el momento exacto. Ahí está. Vale. Aquí se va a comprar uno. Looks like we're not the only ones being invaded. They're headed down to Promethea too. Mi mano por Promethea. Oh, Didn't you say your brother was down there? He's a survivor, right? I'm sure he'll be okay. Octavio. Uh, yeah, he, um, he's. I mean, you both came out of that Malawan ordeal, okay? Yeah. Es un poco gamberro. He's usually able to handle himself, but he's, well, he's sort of a small-time hustler. Wow. He gets into the middle of everything. Armed TDO guards are exactly the type of threat he'd mouth off to and then be executed by. Well, that paints a picture. Oh, God. Let him be doing something quietly indoors for a change. I have to get down there and find him. He needs me. Well, hear me out. Maybe you let your brother save his own life while you save yours. You don't have a brother, do you? Only child. But I always imagine it'd be like having a pet, but dirtier? There isn't a life for me with Atlas. And there isn't a life worth living if it doesn't include Octavio in it. So I'm getting off of this tin can, one way or another. Well, there's only one way. And it's with a launch pod. Follow me. Vale, vale, vale. Tenemos cápsula de lanzadera entonces, ¿no? Entiendo. Uf. Porque no era un cute, que si no me pilla desprotegido 100%. Vamos a Space Marine. <risa> oh oh. Vale, estos son desde Dior. How am I gonna get into a launch pod without being noticed? By asking me to cause one hell of a distraction. You may not have noticed with your head buried in your research, but we're friends. This is what friends do. And besides, causing a scene, that's something at which I excel. Fong, thank you. Yeah, don't mention it. Seriously, I have a reputation to uphold. You be careful out there, all right? You too, please. Oh, and hey, take this for me. I don't want these TDR bastards getting their hands on my lucky vault lander. It'll be safer with you. Una Is this cámara. you? Yeah, I won it in a stupid contest or whatever. No big deal. It's just like the only one in existence. Super rare and wasted on someone who doesn't play. But whatever, just get out of here before I change my mind. Bueno, se han dado una figura de pesca cámara, algo. Gracias de nuevo. Right. Momento crítico, so, eh. I'm headed back that way. You go this way. There's a launch pod ahead. Make sure you get yourself in it. Hey Tidior! I hear you're looking for a vault key. I know exactly where Strong Fort put it. Quick question though, are any of you allergic to jabbers? <laughs> Me estoy quedando loco con todo esto, poca broma. 
Me está molando mucho lo que es la historia. Estamos viendo cosas aquí, un poquito de todo, ¿no? Y es pues lo que te digo, desde <risa> ver aquí la pelea que ha tenido en este caso... Eh... <risa> Me ha hecho muchas gracias eh. lo del yogulado. O sea, es que ha sido muy topo. Aquí Anu, pues lo que digo, también tiene... Ojo, que le ha pasado a este tedior. Se lo han reventado. I'm sorry, I'm about to profit off your violent end. Okay. Y ahora qué? Hold on, Octavio. I'm coming. Pues vamos a por Octavio. Woo. Música con, con, con copyright, así que vamos a cambiar un poquito. Vamos al lío. Y ahí está. ¿Eh? ¿Qué? ¡Timey! ¡Madre mía, la que se está liando, gente! Y esto está cayendo hacia abajo. Esto va a explotar, esto va a reventar. Y no sabemos qué vamos a poder hacer aquí. Pero bueno, eh, no, 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 no caeremos en el France, ¿no? ¡Oh! ¡Meteorito! ¡Que se viene, que se viene a tope el meteorito! ¡Madre mía, la locura que está pasando aquí! Esto no es normal. Todo está por estallar. <risa> y bueno, parece que aquí están, lo que digo, los, eh, los bandidos haciendo de las suyas. ¿No? Y esto parece que va hacia abajo, pero a niveles estelares. Ahí está. Estamos cayendo en picado. Y ojo que aquí... Eh, tenemos la cápsula, pero esto de dentro que lleva un coche. ¡Sí! ¡Oh! ¡Qué guapo! Un coche de Riz. Eh, bueno, hemos bajado a la superficie de alguna manera. <risa> no me digáis que no es una locura, eh. ¡Wey! ¡Cuidado! <risa> pues bueno, lo que digo, locura total. Eh, estamos, parece que en eh, Prometea, ¿no? Un lugar bastante importante dentro de Pandora. Y aquí con el coche, eh, cuidado, esto puede ser muy top. Bueno, el coche de Rir, ojo, aparte de ahí, bien. Jejeje, eh, 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 mejor que en el 1 ha ido. <ríe> Madre mía, el coche de Rir, pobrecillo. Nada, Rir nos quiere matarnos, lo siguiente. Y aquí parece que tenemos a. ¿Dónde? Eh. ¿Estás viva? No sé si nos quieren matar o no, pero bueno, aquí parece que volvemos de nuevo con Octavio. ¿Qué? ¿Cómo? Y Lowe's nos deja solo. Vale. Y este está meando. Pues nada, lo típico. Son las 11 y 32. El tiempo es bonito en Prometea. Are you playing one of those insipid interactive narrative video games? No. This is my Echodex 4520. Se parece al Vita Brazo de Digimon, no digo más. <risa> also known as Mobile. What does a Pahone do? Everything. It's so much better than the standard Echodex. I can communicate with my pals, take and scan images, play executable programs, watch the big game. What is the big game? Which everyone is on. Anyway, the best thing about this baby is I had a jailbroken. Forget about your standard Econet. I'm coasting through the shadows. With these black market executables, I can gather all kinds of information about people without them noticing. Who is them? You know, corporations, man. Gatekeepers, suits, the squares. Those chumps can't box me in. I'm a disruptive entrepreneur. I use every competitive edge I can get. Sounds complicated. I prefer the simple life of learning someone's name and then murdering them. <laughs> If you oh, to well. let me socialize here, I suggest you do me a simple courtesy. Perform secret background bounty checks on all your friends, so I don't reflexively fire two ion slugs into their brains. Even Diamond Danielle might have aliases with bounties. It's still the same brain when I fire slugs into it. Bueno, pues parece que hay que conocer a nuestros amigos y demás. Aquí estamos dándolo todo. 
Y qué puedo decir, esto es bastante, bastante top Espero que os haya molado este segundo gameplay de The, The New Tale from the Borderlands La verdad que me lo he pasado en grande Pero parece que ahora tenemos una parte de exploración aquí con el crack de Octavio Y así pues bueno, le puedo meter en la tercera mini Podemos meter a Octavio, ¿no? Como prota para que tenga su fragmento Porque con él hasta ahora habíamos tenido básicamente escenas En las que nos hemos estado desplazando Igual que con Fran Realmente a la única que hemos controlado un poquito más de momento ha sido Anu Y ahora pues hay que ver un poquito, ¿no? Qué tal continúa la aventura en este juegazo Nada más que decir si os ha molado el vídeo, por favor, dejad el buen like, suscribiros al canal para más contenido del juego y nos vemos en el próximo vídeo aquí, like a vos, para ver un poquito cómo continúa esta increíble aventura. Soy yo, Solero, esto es KTS, si dejáis un buen like, os lo agradezco y apoyáis así la serie y nada más, os leo en comentarios. ¡Hasta luego!